What's up everybody, it's just Dave here, and I was going to do a review on this uh, S107G gyroscope system. Uh, it's a metal series, three channel infrared RC mini helicopter. Own space in the sky. Uh, special indoor design, three way precision control, adjustable trim control, and rechargeable lion poly battery. So, I picked this up at uh, my local gas station, believe it or not. Thirty dollars, and I thought, well, that is too good of a deal to pass up. So I got this helicopter, and uh, get a better close up here. Um, it works really well, uh, a lot better than I thought. I've, I mean, I've bought in stuff in the past that's cost eighty dollars, and doesn't seem to work as well as this one. Got your on-off here. Uh, you can see, you kind of get some blinking lights going there. Um, it's got the. Uh, one way and then the other way on the blades uh... very you know mobile centrifugal motion keeps the blade straight and the weight at the top um, it's got a little rotor in the back here um, lets you go forward backwards and turn left to right well that actually doesn't let you turn left to right but uh... so anyways um, you got a little charger there and along with that charger port you have a spot on your remote control here that in the back you can let take the wire out like I did right there and that allows you to charge it. Um, along with that comes a little USB cable that uh, you can plug into your computer and charge it from your computer which is pretty cool because uh, you hate to kill off your battery so much uh, using this thing. So. Lift it up a little better for you guys to see. Um, so, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and give it some lift off here and let you guys see how well it works. So I can keep it mostly on camera. So, again, it gives nice control. Um, it gives you that forward, backwards motion. And normally, if I don't have this box in the way of pulling off of it. You can usually keep it pretty stationary. The higher you take it, of course, the better stationary it stays. Uh, it's got really good turn motions. Turn left and right. Go up and down just from the throttle you use. Or forward or backwards. As you see here. Um, again, it's easy to learn. It says 14 plus. Uh, but younger than that can definitely learn how to use it. There's no putting it together. Um, it lasts, it takes about 40 to 50 minutes to charge it, and it lasts about 6 or 7, maybe even 8 minutes, depending on how you fly it. Um, again, it's got nice controls to land well, pick right back up, and even sometimes when you do drop it on its side, like that, sometimes you can pick it back up. It's just not going to want to do it for me. There it goes. So, pretty cool. Uh, you know, for 30 bucks, I definitely thought it was worth checking out. Especially where, I, like I said, I got it from the uh, gas station. So, um, let me know what you guys think and what you guys have found maybe better deals on. And yeah, if you torque it too much on that motor, it will turn it off. So a lot of safety features. I've dropped this thing from it hitting my ceiling, falling back down, and uh, just getting right back up and going. So it's definitely a, a pretty hard-duty, metal-cased um, helicopter. Uh, on the controllers here, you know, you got your up and down here. It falls right back down, so you got your throttle resistance here. Uh, you got your trim down here, so if it's starting to turn one direction when you just go up, then you can adjust your trim, and then you got your left, right, up, and down. Um, and, you know, the way you hold it, you can make it do really tight spins or large circle spins. Uh, so, um, and you just got your on and off switch at the top there. No, that's your A and B, your on and offs right here. So you can pick up two different frequencies there. And those don't do nothing. That's top. So, take six AA batteries, and uh, it's already got the 
uh, ion battery, uh, lithium battery in there. And I think that's about all about what I can say about it, but the S107G, you should be able to find it locally, maybe at a Radio Shack or Walmart. Um, like I said, I found mine at a gas station, and it's working out well for me. So check it out. Uh, let me know if you have any questions in the section below. Uh, help me out by hitting that like button or subscribe. Thanks.